folks, welcome back. First video in a while. I've uh, unfortunately succumbed to uh, an injury a couple of weeks ago. Woke up with uh, tendonitis in my Achilles. Uh, I don't know what caused it and uh, was barely able to walk for about a week. And then got the unfortunate uh, event of the kid bringing home logies from school. So uh, fell, fell ill for a week or so. so just not really felt like riding. Although I have been doing a bit of indoor training, uh, I've not really got out on the bike. Uh, so today's the first real um, outing as such. I have commuted to work uh, this week, which was nice to get on the bike. Um, so yeah, just out for a little ride today, only about 25, 30k, not too much. Uh, but I'm doing something a little bit different today. Bit of, uh, Bit of bumpy gravel, uh, as you can see. So I've uh, climbed up into the uh, up to Scout Moor, which is just in the distance there, and then come across the, uh, the fields there next to Ashworth Valley Reservoir. And I'm just going to drop down into Ramsbottom now and uh, and enjoy the route down there. And see where it takes. I've never done this one before, so it should be uh, should be quite nice. So yeah. Uh, Come along with me and, uh, and enjoy the ride. So while I've been uh, not feeling so great, I uh, oh, I'll just get going. So while I've not been feeling so great, I haven't uh, I haven't been sat idle. I've been uh, spending money, boxing uh, boots. I uh, oh no, I can't ride on this. I'm going to have to stop. <laughs> uh, yeah, I've been plotting routes and uh, spending money. So I got myself a, uh, see it there, uh, Garmin Varia radar. Um, I sometimes have a few cloth shaves on the on the commute to work, and I thought better being safe than sorry. I'm going to get a camera for the, but uh, I wanted to get something for the back, uh, which links in nicely with the Wahoo, um, which I'm probably missed again today, unfortunately. Uh, but the new update's great, that they brought out, which uh, links in with the lights. Uh, so if you've got Amplus lights, you can turn them on and off and, and what have you. And uh, most of all, if you, if you play music while you're riding, it'll, uh, it'll allow you to control that as well. I think that's something I tend to do, but uh, I can see how that's a cool feature. I have used it on the indoor trainer though, that is, that is a game changer. So yeah, really good. Uh, so yeah, uh, I'm, I've been planning Pretty big uh, route in, I'm not sure what I'm gonna do. I'm hoping April, perhaps May, but uh, around, I mentioned it's still around the York area. Um, I've, got a, I've got a few things in, in mind for that and it's gonna be a, a bit of a video series. So uh, hopefully get on with that soon. Uh, really, really looking forward to doing that. I've uh, got most of the routes planned now. Um, but I'm, I'm not going to give anything more away, so uh, we'll we'll uh, we'll leave it at that with that one. Uh, but yeah, I'm going to get on and enjoy this ride today. Uh, so I'll uh, I'll catch you shortly. <laughs> 